Hello, my dudes and dudettes. Welcome back to the channel. I am Beanie Boy, and today we are playing Stardew Valley on the Nintendo Switch. So, it's bright and early in the morning, and my little dude, this is me, actually, if I imagined myself as a farmer. Got a little dungarees on and a hat. We're just going to head out, um, because it's harvest time on Avondale Farm, and we've got a ton of work to do. So the first thing we're going to do is just harvest some beans. Now guys, I've been working on this farm for a little while. I'm in year two, and I'm not the most experienced Stardew Valley player. However, I do enjoy it. it it's a rather good game. Oh, accidentally destroyed a bit of the uh, floor there. It's all right. I'll replace that in a minute. It's not a problem. So, you may be wondering why my fields are a bit oddly shaped. There is a reason for that. Just down the middle here, we've got sprinklers. And they are to give my crops some daily water. And that is going to make these beans the best beans Stardew Valley has ever seen. So, <laughs> I've just been avoiding this game. I got really addicted to it last time I got on it. And it was just so, I don't know, it's just so relaxing. It's almost therapeutic to play. Uh, I do enjoy it quite a lot. Right, let's just fix that. No, I didn't want to put it there. Oh my god, so what am I doing? It's been a while, guys, as I've said. So, right, let's just put that down. We'll go check the animals. That field's not looking entirely... Oh god, what's happened over here? I must have harvested that one last time I played, right? Good morning, chickies. Let's just have a look in the cow shed, see. Yeah, they've got a ton of food. Over the winter, we do need to be careful of their food supplies, but right now they seem to be doing all right. Um, I've got some grass seeds in there, so that's going to help them out. Oh, we have some eggs on the floor. We should pick these up. It's kind of nice being able to do farming again, because I don't know if any of you know, I used to actually be a farmer myself. I uh, studied agriculture at a place called Plumpton in Sussex. It was quite fun. But, as many of you also probably know, if you've watched any of the other videos, I'm a vegan. So, as for farming practices, not a fan. However, when it's in a virtual environment, it can be overlooked. It's a shame, really, because the, the lifestyle of a farmer is actually quite peaceful. It's very, you know... But it's just got too big, hasn't it, really? It's just... Everybody eats meat nowadays. It's just, uh, I think it's more of a population issue than a meat-eating issue, personally. But take away from that what you will. Right, let's cut back some of this grass. See if we can just keep this under control. We don't want that spreading too far out. Right. So... I've got an ingenious system for sorting out my crops. I've got this silver chest here, and this is specifically for silver produce. And then I've got the gold chest just on the other side, and that is for gold produce. Um, right, so let's just have a quick look. See, do we have any geodes to go? I don't think we do. So I guess we can just go to the mines in a minute. Let's get rid of these eggs, send them over to Pierre's in the village. Oh, I've just realised I have to put the sprinklers back. If I hope to get any more beans this year. I think there's only about six days left of the season, so... I don't think we're going to get much more out of this, to be honest. But that's why I've saved up all of my, my good food, because usually there's like a Christmas thing on Stardew Valley. Um, oh, what? Oh, did I put the eggs in here? I did, didn't I? Damn. I should have saved them to make mayonnaise. Never mind. All right, let's just um, let's just pop off to the mine then, I guess. We'll try and get some doula. 
I've got a really long, convoluted way to go. Um, because I wanted to put this field quite close to my house so I could keep an eye on it. Oh, we should probably check in here, see if there's any mushrooms that have grown. There are. Excellent. We'll take these. I'm not going to take any food with me to the mine shaft, though. That just doesn't seem like a a good thing to do right now. I need to keep as much as I can for sale. I do like this little pathway. Sometimes you can forage some good stuff here. We've got a couple of wormies sticking out of the ground there. That's just... Oh, wrong, wrong item. I was pretty sure... Oh, no. Yeah, it's, God, it's been so long since I've played. A lost library book. We can return that because we're a good Stardew Valley citizen. <laughs> Right, let's just uh, pop over here. Oh, he's not out. He's probably having a lay-in, to be honest, but never mind. Oh, no, there he is, down by the... Hello, Linus. Have you come to ridicule me? No, of course not. I'm a good Stardew Valley citizen. Right, so into the mines we go. We're going to try and, uh, you know, find some bits and pieces. I've unlocked pretty much every level, to be honest. Let's go into a 100... We'll see if we can find some geodes. And that's going to get us a bit of dosh. Oh, hello. I need my sword out. Oh, I'm facing the wrong way. I was looking at the uh, menu bar as opposed to what I was actually doing as a character. Now a bomb. That's a good start. Let's just plough through here. Right, guys. I'm going to just speed through. And we're going to try and get as much as we can out of this mine as possible. So, do bear with. So, this is... Level 2, guys. Smash through level 1. There wasn't really much up there, to be honest. But down here, we should have a bit more luck. I have to admit, the mining is probably one of the most fun parts of the game. It's, it's a little bit like Minecraft, to be honest. I do have another game called Terraria, which I haven't played much of. But I've heard it's good. If any of you guys have had a gander at Terraria... Please let me know in the comments below because I kind of, uh, I started on it. It was alright, not too bad, but it it wasn't, it wasn't Minecraft. And admittedly, like, Stardew Valley kind of feels a little bit like a hybrid of Minecraft and Animal Crossing, I'd say. But So we're just going to carry on smashing through these rocks and get to the third level. I'm just down here to make a bit of extra revenue, to be honest, for the farm. And we've got autumn coming in, or fall as it's called in Stardew. And we're going to be buying some nice new seeds to plant. Hopefully we'll be able to get a good yield of pumpkins or something this year. So, Anyway, moving on. Oh god, guys, so I've, I've hit the third level. There's absolutely loads of monsters down here. I'm just going to have to fight these dudes off. One thing I do love about Stardew Valley is the um, energy system. It's really cool to actually have a game where your character has a certain amount of energy. That's really quite an interesting touch, to be honest. Oh god, there's so many. I think I'm going to use a bomb. Let's just put that down there. We should be able to blow a lot of them up, to be honest. Not quite, but we did a fair bit of damage. Just kill the rest of them. Oh god, it's been so long since I've played. I used to be a pro at the combat in Stardew, but... Right, we've done... We've killed most of them, just this guy left to go. There we go. Right, let's just see what's down here. Oh god, there's another one. I didn't even see him. Quick, get him back, 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 back. Oh, and there's the exit. Okay, well... We're at level 103. There's a couple more guys hiding over here. We'll just kill them. They seem to have glitched, to be honest. Never mind. More for me. And whatever this is. I think it's ruby. Yeah, that's good. Oh, and some extra stuff there. Right, let's move to the next level, guys. See if we can find anything more valuable. So, <laughs> one thing uh, I've... I've noticed in every RPG ever there does seem to be blob enemies and like it's they're kind of from the Legend of Zelda I guess like or maybe beyond if you guys know what the uh, blo generic blob 
monster appeared in first, do let me know. They just seem to make their way into pretty much every RPG, really. Need to watch that health bar. That's getting a bit low. Oh, God! What the hell is that? I've never even seen that before. Can we... Can I just eat a mushroom? Is that going to help? Is that going to make me feel ill? I don't know. Did that actually help? Yeah, it's giving me some energy and some health, so why not? I've just noticed the clock. It's 7 p.m. That's another interesting thing that Stardew Valley does that a lot of other games tend to overlook. You have to go to bed. It kind of forces you to, unlike in Minecraft, where you have to stay up and... Well, you don't have to. They did try to put the old phantoms in to keep you from ignoring your uh, sleeping, but... I quite like a game that forces you to go to bed because it it feels like there's a real progression of time, so But yes. I do like me a bit of Stardew Valley. Oh god, here come the bats. This is not good. I don't have a lot of health either. Damn. Should probably Aha! Here's the way down. Excellent. Good work. If I do say so myself. Uh, I reckon we could do a couple more floors, maybe, if we go quick. Let's just smash through this. Doesn't seem to really be much at these levels, to be honest. We'll just work our way back to the ladder, because if we don't find the downwards ladder soon, we're not going to get very far. So I'm just going to... Oh, a couple of geodes, a couple more. Very, very lucky. We'll have to take those tomorrow to the uh, blacksmith and see what he can do with them. I just love it. It's such a relaxing, chilled game. It's it's so nice to play. Definitely check it out if you uh, you do have a moment. And if you haven't played it in particular, it's kind of like one of those classic games that everybody should have a go on at some point, I reckon. Kind of like Man Eater, although <laughs> Stardew Valley is nothing like Man Eater. But I did a, I did a video for Man Eater, and damn, that game was surprising. It was actually really good. I enjoyed it anyway. Right, let's just kill this little whipper snapper, and then we'll go back home. Oh God! Do you know what? I'm just gonna grab the mushroom, and then I'm gonna go sod this. Right, it's now a race home. Oh, no. Okay, this is worth it. Oh, I don't know. Just get rid of him. Get away. Oh, God. If he, like, hits me once, that's it. Oh, I don't know what I got there. A secret note. We're so not making it home, guys. But we are. We're going to make it home. A couple of diamonds. See, it was all worth it in the long run. Right, sod this. I'm out. F this. <laughs> I'm out. Almost said something rude then. Probably shouldn't do that. Right. It's very dark. In Stardew Land. I've got ten minutes to get home. I feel like I'm running home to my mum. <gasps> I can imagine the wife being like, Where have you been? Although I don't have a wife in Stardew Valley yet. Um... To be honest, I don't know how to get a wife in Stardew Valley. It's probably expensive. <laughs> We're almost back. So guys, if you if you don't get home in time in Stardew Valley, you end up passing out on the ground. And I assume there's somebody that just comes and retrieves your body and drags you home. But you lose uh, half your energy for the following day, so it is kind of important to get home. Also, it fills your health up. Let's just put the fire on for my cat Sophie there. Right, in we go to bed. Oh. <laughs> Day 23 of spring in the year two. Uh, most of my money came from farming. That's good, isn't it? Given that it's a farming game. Oh, right. Here we go, let's just check the weather report. 
Welcome to Cozy 5, your number one source for weather, news and entertainment. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to rain all day. That's not good, is it? Queen of Sauce rerun? Okay. Learn how to cook hash browns. Fortune Teller, welcome back to Waywick's Oracle. If you seek hidden knowledge of the future, well, you've come to the right place. The spirits are in good humour today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. What a glorious day. And how many days of the year do we have left? We've got one, two, three, four. They said there was some kind of weird dance today, didn't they? So, got a letter. What's this? Dear Luke, tomorrow we're getting... Oh, okay. Yes, we've already read that. Right, I guess we could check our crops if we've got anything going on down here. Requires scythe. Okay, we can we can take some of this. It's just unmilled rice. Can we build a mill? Probably can. Have to go have a look in a moment. This is pretty much it for the crops for the year. I don't think I'm going to be able to plant anything else. There is the possibility, but... Oh, my inventory appears to be full. Let's just... Alright, we got to go dump some stuff in the chest. We've got a ton of stuff in the inventory, right? Uh, coal, copper, tree sap, which shouldn't be in that chest. We don't put tree sap in there. Mix seeds, stone, magma geode. We need the geodes, actually. Slime... Amethyst, uh, yeah, put that in there, why not? Aquamarine, diamond, emeralds, we had a really good run. Gold ore, quartz, iron ore, clay. Fantastic work, topaz. And the thing I love about this as well, Minecraft, take note, Mojang, organize button, seriously, you need it. I don't understand why Minecraft doesn't have an organized button. It just makes no sense. Right, let's just go back and get the rest of that rice. I love how it just, like, floats into me. I think I've got a... Uh... Oh, that's weird. That one's not ready yet. Well, it's doing my OCD in, so it is ready. Oh, God. Hit the wrong one. Uh... Sprinklers. Right, let's just pop that down. That field's ready for the new year. Are the cows doing all right? Hello, how you doing? Right, it's just ch chickens. Chickens are good. Got some eggs, nice. Do enjoy uh, collecting stuff in Stardew. It's really good. I'm not entirely sure what that abandoned building there is, but. I should really do a stream with Stardew where I start a farm and we kind of go from the very beginning. I just thought I'd give it a try. I've seen that Stardew Valley is quite popular when it comes to streaming. so Right, so we've got our rice. We're just going to divide into good and great rice. Most of it was great, to be honest. Right, there we go. One good egg and one silver egg. It's all fantastic news today. Got some stuff to take to the market as well. So we're gonna we're gonna head down to Pierre's and see if we can sell some bits and pieces. Let's go. Just spotted a dandelion. Should grab that. Oh, lovely. Maybe I could give it to someone while I'm in town. And a random turnip. Is that a turnip? A leek. Coming out of the floor. Such a chilled game. I love it. Right. I hope the shop's open. It's locked. Great. The shop's closed. Well, I guess we could possibly go and see what they're doing. I can't even remember where they said they were. This guy might know. Let's have a look. Hello. You've been here a while now, haven't you? Your farm must be thriving. It certainly is, my friend. How about you, little boy? <laughs> I want to look for bugs, but mum gets mad when I'm all dirty. It's a tough choice. Do you know what? I think you should live, dude. Just live. 
Go and uh, collect bugs until your heart's content. And that goes for any of you guys listening. Just live. Be your best self. Collect bugs if you want to. Oh, hello. This is the, the mayor, I think. Hello, Lewis. Hmm, tax collection, mumble. Spring festivities, expenses, mumble. God, you're a miser, aren't you? What's going on here? Oh. Let's see if the blacksmith's open. That'll probably be a good shout. Oh, I've got that lost library book, haven't I? Have I still got it? All oh, right, fair enough. I've picked it up and it's disappeared somewhere. That's locked too. Fantastic. Right, guys, I'm going to have a little look around and see if I can find anyone. Who's this? Jas. All right, don't talk to strangers. I like it. Kids, never talk to strangers, even if they're a pixelated farmer. You just shouldn't do it. All right. So they're not here. <laughs> they must be at the community center then. Do, 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 do. Another dandelion. I'm going to woo some ladies with my dandelions. <laughs> that I found. Be like, here you go. I found your weird. <laughs> All right. They're not at the community center. What is going on? The letter, actually, <laughs> the letter probably said where they were, but I've just ignored it. So, All right, let's just circle around. We'll we'll circle around and go back to the post post box, and the letter is sure to tell us. I think they only said they were partying until two, though. So maybe you've missed it. <laughs> Who knows? Let's just grab that horseradish. I always wondered why it was called horseradish. I know it goes damn well with a uh, roast dinner, though, so... Right, there is one more place I think they could be. If not, I'm not interested in the dance, even though I got an invite. Are they down here? Yes, they are. Time has frozen for this... This dance. <laughs> so, right, here we go. Sup, my homies. Yo, what's up, Pierre? Oh, I've been... Are they daffodils? Okay, fair enough. Rare crow? Get me one of them. I'm happy I brought some uh, money with me. Seasonal plants? This decoration changes with the season. You know what? I'll get some plants. Why not? They're, in, they're quite cheap. We'll get... Let's get four of each. Should probably save the rest of my money. I've got a farm to run. Hello! Whoa! I'm stuffed. Hey, have you tried the jelly yet? Do you know what? I haven't. I wish Pierre would spend this time with the family. Well, he's trying to make a bit of money, isn't he? Who are these guys? Elliot. I wore my best t-shirt for the dance. This sort of thing doesn't happen very often. Hi, Luke. Glad to see you here. Oh, God, you guys know my real name now. Literally. Plot twist. All right. Hello. Abigail. I really hate dancing in front of everyone. It's so embarrassing. So so I'm looking at this game, and it's... Uh, let's just say... There's, there's this dude here and nobody else, just to, to be PC about it. I'm going to talk to him. Yo, Demetrius. These springtime dances can be tracked to an ancient fertility ritual. Oh, Mr. Blacksmith, I'll be seeing you tomorrow. I wonder if Emily would dance with me. Why don't you ask her? Uh, no, well, I'm going to ask. I'm very sorry, but I've already agreed to dance with somebody else. Uh, he's just staring on. What about you? I like dancing, but this one's a little... Stilted. The old timers really love it, though. I'm working up the courage to ask someone to dance with me. Gulp. I'm nervous. Marnie looks lovely today. Who's Marnie? Oh, there you go. Marnie. Sigh. Love is in the air and I'm still single. What about you? Do you want to dance? I'm practicing my dance move. I need to be perfect. I don't have a date. 
I'm going to be the flower queen. What about this old lady? Can I dance with her? I've been working on these floral arrangements for weeks. Do you like them? Okay. Ugh. I love this guy. Whatever his name is. Sebastian. Sam, do you know what? Admit it. I like flowers. I am... Let's just... Let's ask... This one. Haley. I've been the flower queen for five years. Ew, no. Okay, fair enough. Screw you. <laughs> um, do you know what? I'm going to go ask the emo. That's flattering, but I'm going to have to say no. Sorry. Does anybody want to dance with me? I feel like, guys, I, I make the food. I'll be honest, I don't want to dance with you. Anybody? What about you? Robin will dance with me, I'm sure. Come on, Robin. They look like a couple already. Okay. What about this person? Hello? <laughs> no! You can keep that. <laughs> oh, no, thanks. Okay, yeah. Just getting rejection. I'm flattered, but no. Do you know what? I'm going to go ask the old lady then. Sod it. No, I'm going to ask the old man. Hello. George. Flowers, I can hardly see them. It's too bright out here. Do you want to dance? No? Nobody wants to dance with me. This is fantastic. What about you? Do you know what? Whatever. Screw you all then. Utter rejection on every level. Oh. <laughs> that was a bit of a... Trying to ask a dude to dance for me. Nice. I don't really know how to progress it. <laughs> dance with me. Somebody, please. Somebody. Okay. Whatever. Nobody, nobody wants to dance with me. This sucks. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm done. Nobody wants to dance with me. Whatever. I'm going to go home and cry. <laughs> go hug a cow or something. <laughs> Screw you guys. Oh, God. I'm cut off by a lake. Right, okay. I guess I'll go back then. There's got to be a way to initiate some kind of dancing. Just get to watch everybody else. Maybe someone will ask me. Who knows? Should have done what Pierre did. Just brought a load of high-priced food. Okay, guys. So I've literally asked everyone. I'm just going to initiate the uh, the dance. It appears that nobody wanted to dance with me. My character hasn't exactly been very sociable over the years. So I guess I'm just watching. So what what is this? Is this like the Mayfair or look at all the the singletons just on the edge staring in it's just like well, you know i i personally wouldn't be able to deal with that if i were there i'd be in the corner getting drunk like oh uh, nobody wanted to dance to, with me it's time to go home today <laughs> today sucked off to bed with my cat and my empty house let's just go to sleep shall we whatever who cares? Good morning and welcome back. I am getting rained on. Excellent. The weather forecast did tell us it was going to rain today though. So I'm just going to have a little stroll into town to be honest. See if we can uh, get these geodes busted open. I wonder where that bus goes. I've never been on that. I should probably check out at some point. Yeah, it's nice that, uh, you know, I've got to get up for work and whoever enjoyed the celebration yesterday, they're just probably laying in bed. Right. Anyway, guys, I'm going to jump to the blacksmith. Off we go. So here we are. Let's just... It's locked. 
opens at nine. Oh my god, are you telling me I've got to like stick around in the rain for like two hours? What about the library? It's locked. Opens at eight. All right, fair enough. Whatever. Guess we'll have a walk then. What's this? Oh, I don't even know to be honest. Any jobs on the board? Fragments of the past, calling an amateur. I need a hundred pieces of bone. Where the hell do I get bone from? I don't know where I get bone from. Anyway, we're going to time jump to the point that the shops are open. Off we go. Okay, so the library is now open. Let's just pop in here. Hello, Mr. Library? Museum? Whatever. What's this? I don't even know what this is. Whatever. Um... Just a quick little explore. Look at how many things I've found. I'm not sure if I have anything to donate at the moment, but... Yeah, I've been a good patron, I think, of this museum. It doesn't seem like you have anything to donate to the museum. Better get out there and do some treasure hunting. That's one thing I never got with games like this. Why can't they just go and do it themselves? I suppose it wouldn't be much of a game, but... Hello. Hi, Penny. The raindrops are really loud on the metal roof of our trailer. Do you know what, Penny? Here's a flower. Thanks. This looks nice. Hey. It's so soothing, though. Oh, I'm just going to keep talking to her, actually. Can I? No, that's it. The dialogue is over. I'm, gonna, I'm literally going to give Penny a present every day. That's my mission now. I need to find out where she lives. God, I sound like a stalker. Right, hello. What's up? How's it going? Uh, let's process some geodes. What have we got in here? Break that open. Clay? Okay. Some stone. Cool. Star shards. Useful. I assume that's like meteorites. Celestine and whatever that is. Barite. Okay. Well, fair enough. Like, that's not... It's not the worst haul, is it? Is there anything else we can do in here? Upgrade tools. We don't have anything to upgrade with, I suppose. We've got to bring... Let's just have a little look. See what we need to bring next. Steel axe. Pickaxe. Right. Five iron bars. That is the mission for tomorrow. Or whatever. Right, we've been in there. If, actually, let's just pop back in the museum see if they can take any of this. Hello? No. Alright, he can't take anything. Back to the farm. Right, so I'm back here at the farm. And I remembered that I brought some flowers. So I'm going to I'm gonna put some flowers down, I think. Can I put them here? No, I can't. Literally, right? In real life, I would put them on that little patio bit. But I can't. And that's really annoying, because that would be, like, the best place for them. Let's just have a little look-see down here. Can I put... I don't really know what to do with them. I brought them, and I'm just like, eh. Oh, God, look at my fields. They're absolutely ragged. I think I could put them up here. This this would be nice. Right, let's just get rid of this tree. Right, here we go. I'm going to make this look lovely. I'm going to put this here. And one of them. Yeah. Maybe a couple of these up here. Do you know what? They look they look better as a, a free. Let's let's do that. Um lines of free, okay. There we go. Oh, lovely. Put some flowers here. Why not? I, could, I think we could fit four there. Never mind. Whatever. Um, and there may be some up here too. Why not? Do these like produce anything? Do you reckon? I don't know. Perhaps. Maybe we can harvest them. Who knows? Okay. So we've done all of that. Let's just check on the animals. Maybe they're inside today. They're all good. They got food. We'll just grab the eggs as well from today's chickies. Thank you very much. 
Are these named? I don't even know. I can't remember. Got to make sure we close that gate. All right. Let's get this in there. Gold produce. Doing really well so far, guys. Got a gold turnip there, or parsnip, or whatever it is. Leek. I got it completely wrong. And we've got the rare crow. We need to put the rare crow out, actually. Let's put the rare crow. Um, let's put it here. Do, 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 do. Cool. Like it. Anything else? No? We'll just chuck a few bits and pieces in the chest here and then we're going to be good to go. All of that is just rubbish. What about that stone? Ah, do you know what? I'll sort it out another day. Anyway, guys, I hope you've enjoyed checking out my farm on Stardew Valley with me today. Do remember to like and subscribe to the channel. I do try to make videos every day when I can. And guys, um, I will be putting up more videos as the week goes on, so do stay tuned. Anyway, wherever you are, I hope you have an excellent day. Remember guys, be excellent to each other. Take care, and we'll see you on the next video. As for me and my farmer, Luke. <laughs>